We are now in Oslo. This is Oslo's best west kant. Yeah. Behind me I have a leaf. This leaf was delivered in October 2018. So supposedly it doesn't have the rapid gate. So let's go inside. It's cold outside. So uh, I'm also live streaming right now. <coughs> okay. So I have everything set up. We have the live stream here. I have leaf spy running here and you see uh, it's actually pretty cold in the battery. It's been this car has been parked outside. What is the ambient temperature? Or? It's zero degrees Celsius. So the pack has been cooled down to about four degrees Celsius. So what we want to find out today is has rapid gate been fixed? Oh, it keeps switching back and forth. What? What? Okay, whatever. Uh, so we will drive um, probably to Shell Copang or whatever. Just do the same test I did before um, and then see how it goes. I have some notes. We're gonna check it out uh, during the trip. So let's let's just get going there. Yeah, okay. Oh yes, we are on the move. Um, I have to take, well, I, I washed the car and I just rinsed it a little bit. It was, it was somewhat dirty. But um, now the temperature is about eight degrees Celsius. And um, I'm going to a Kia. Yeah, a little small task, but my own task is I have to go to Kia and pick up a memory card. Yeah, and then we can head for uh, the north. We have been driving for uh, about an hour, I think. I, I don't know. Uh, consumption is 178, that's low. Um, and we have 75% state of charge left. And if we look here, we have 10 degrees Celsius on the highest sensor. We have several sensors, but I'm looking at the highest one. So 10 degrees Celsius, now yeah, that's looking good. Um, I'm getting hungry though, so I kind of want to stop, but we have to keep going. We have to uh, drive it down to uh, maybe about 20%, then we can charge up. Yeah, And it's also too early to charge now. If we try to fast charge right now, we will get shitty speed because the temperature is at 10, 10 degrees. We have to get the temperature up to about 25, 30. Then we get better speed. Well, look at that. Uh, Mjosa. Mjos. Yeah, my Mjosa, that's the correct name. But the, the Norway's biggest lake is so quiet today. No wind, which is good because my consumption is actually, uh, what, what do you say? It's, it's simply amazing. Simply amazingly low. 17 or 170. Yeah. Uh, temperature is now. Uh, 15 um, so I've decided to skip Espa and go for Schellöten which is about 30 well I can't trust this number 34 uh, it's probably like 36 37 uh, real distance this seems to be air distance yeah but uh, okay looking good so far dry roads uh, plus 3 degrees Celsius yeah so good driving conditions we are now at Shell Löten. Average has been 173. We are down to, hang on a minute, just there. We're down to 16%. Temperature is plus one degree Celsius. And uh, over here, we have 19 degrees Celsius in the pack. Yeah, let's start charging. All right, we are plugged in now. And great news. You know what? Hey, this is a bit different. Uh, we are getting we're getting 41.5 kilowatt at only 19 degrees Celsius uh, It's you know, it's supposed to be lower. I'm pretty sure it's supposed to be lower I can okay. We have documented this now. I, I can check uh, with earlier results, but At 19 degrees Celsius, you're not supposed to get 40 uh, kilowatt. It's supposed to be like 35 or something. So it seems like um, Nissan has changed they have changed the BMS to probably allow higher charging speed at lower and at higher temperature or something like that. Huh, interesting. But either way, okay, so I will um, have to go to the restroom, I have to get some food and so on. We have uh, Shell right here, so yes. Okay, we are back in the car. I just went to the restroom and grabbed some food. So this is bad food, this is Neymar, no food. Well, that's what they call it. I, just, I get sun in my face. Hang on, let me do this. No, wait. No, 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 no. Okay, whatever. Um, so it's just a, um, a bacon sausage. Yeah. So 
Mm. Mm. Good stuff. But look here. It's 26 degrees Celsius and it's charging like a boss. So, um, we are gaining um, energy and um, 40, 43 kilowatt already. That is, that is fast, man. I'm pretty sure they changed something. Wow. Okay, uh, I finished the hot dog and you see we are at 65% right now here on the display. And right now the, the, the display state of charge and the real state of charge is uh, almost alike. Yeah, they are actually spot on now, 66, 66. Uh, the speed has started decreasing, see. Uh, we're getting 33 kilowatts, so it started throttling around 60 something already. Or actually around 50, 55, 50, I don't remember. The temperature has gone up quite a lot. <laughs> we are up to 34 soon. Um, and we have 105 kilometers to destination. See, let me show you something here, which is... A stupid feature with the leaf, which is that here, I mentioned before, you know, that's 87 kilometers air distance. But if you go to NAV and then you go to root info, then here's the actual distance, 105 kilometers, right, to Shell Koppang. So why the heck can't it show 105 kilometers here? Huh? Huh? What the heck? Okay, but um, um, that means we have to drive 100 and was again 105 kilometers. Okay, um, yeah, we have it. We have enough now, and this is quite. This is simply amazing because we arrived here with what was in 15 percent. And you see here, there's a timer. We stayed here only 24 minutes, and we are good to go already. Ho ho ho! That is nice. All right, we are on the move, and the consumption has been ridiculously low because uh, because the stretch before um, uh, Elverum is so slow. Yeah, and then we have some road construction here, so we have to take it easy. And because we've been driving so slow, then you see the temperature in the pack has dropped, so it's now down to. Oh, hang on, let me try to adjust here. Thirty points there. As it, the, the temperature pack is is lower. Uh, but hopefully it will go up soon once we can hit the higher speeds or high-ish speeds. Yeah, that's yeah, I know it's not that fast over here, but we can cruise at 88 kilometers per hour, which is um, barely legal. Wow, look here! Look at that sunset! Oh, nice! What a reward! It's three in the afternoon and the sun is setting already. Oh shit! Pro pilot went off. Wow! That is some nice colors, yes. You know what they say? I heard it from Lord of the Rings. That if the clouds, I mean if the sunset is like this, this red color, it means that blood has been shed. <laughs> I don't know, but it's, it's nice to look at, yeah. So um, anyway, uh, temperature is actually dropping now. It's at 33.4 and it's slowly dropping. And we are cruising at 88 kilometers per hour. So, um, yeah, we have to see. We still have about one more hour of driving. We are now cruising along in uh, Österdalen. And the consumption has gone up. It has gone up to 176. The reason why it's high is probably because the road is wet here and uh, we are gaining a little bit of elevation. Yeah. So, uh, temperature. Is actually dropping to my surprise. Well, actually, you know what? I think it's supposed to slowly drop. Yeah, because uh, two days ago when I drove uh, and it didn't drop, that was because I have headwind, massive headwind. But now it's slowly dropping, so hopefully by the time we get to the fast charger, we should get full speed again. Yeah. We are now at uh, Shell Koppang. We arrive here with. Um 12% on the display, it's minus 7 degrees Celsius outside. Consumption was somewhat high as expected. Uh, we've gone up hill a bit, 179, all right. And if you look here, leaf spy tells me that the temperature is now 32.4 and the real stellar charge is 22%. All right, let's plug in and see what happens. All right, uh, according to the table earlier, 
32 kilowatt, I mean, sorry, 32 per, <laughs> 32 degrees Celsius should give me 42 kilowatt. What, what, why is that one higher now? Uh, is that the one I should look at? So we're getting 42 kilowatt. Hmm, that's pretty good. Yeah. Uh, so still no rapid gate, second fast charging. Um, it could be that because we have somewhat low temperature, so the, the battery has been cooling, but so now it's the third charging session we want to look at because then um, the battery will be warmer, over 40 degrees, hopefully, and then we see we can try to um, to uh, provoke some rapid gate. Then, all right, we've been charging for a little bit, not too long. Uh, this timer is a bit off now. I don't know why, but um, the temperature is rising fast, so um, the, the the streamers want me to breathe restart the charging session once it hit 38 um, degrees Celsius. Well, actually, we have to look at that one. Isn't it the highest one? So it's actually now. We have to restart the charging session. According to earlier um, rapid gate results, we should get only 28 kilowatt at this temperature. So let's see what happens. All right, we just restarted and... Whoa! This is great news. Let's fire up the car and uh, turn off the heater. Wow! If this was the old version of Leaf, it would rapid gate and go down to 28 kilowatt. Now we're getting 40 kilowatt. So this is actually hard proof that they have fixed. Well, okay, they have fixed um, the rapid gate throttling but what is the result of this like um, <laughs> do we do we get more degradation is this a trade-off that we um, we degrade the battery faster by allowing high temperature hmm we don't know yet okay uh, we will uh, restart again 41 degrees Celsius that's pretty hot and we should still get 40 is it we're getting 40 kilowatt right now let's restart again Okay, so it was 41 degrees Celsius when we uh, unplugged. I plug in again, and wow, wow. Uh, it was 40 kilowatt. Maybe it's doing some throttling right now. I mean, maybe it's doing some ramp up. This is speed I have never seen before at these temperatures. Look, 40 degrees, and we are still getting. 38.5 kilowatt if this was rapid gate um, in the old version we would get about 25 27 kilowatt all right now I'm going to show you how you can enter the service menu to, to uh, see the um, uh, the firmware information so first you have to make sure that uh, you are in FM mode like right now see okay uh, if you are in dub mode or whatever, then it doesn't work. It just bugs or something. So just mute this one. Okay. So, um, so now we are like in the. Well, okay. Let's just go back here. All right. Uh, come on, back. <coughs> okay. I'm not sure what's wrong, but let's just do it. Okay. So the procedure is you press map three times, and then audio, audio, and then map again. And now you are in the system diagnostics, me diagnostics menu, but just be careful when you're here. Uh, you can break something if you mess around here. So what you want to do is go down here and uh, just scroll down a bit. Version information, okay? Go here. Okay, so you can see the version here and we can try to compare with, with, uh, with the other car I tested. When I went to Gothenburg, okay. There's more stuff here. Yeah. All right, we've been here about half an hour. I don't know for sure because we restarted the charging sessions, but um, uh, we are at um, 78%. You see here, 78, still minus 7 degrees Celsius. Um, and over here, it says. 74 something and we should have enough juice to go back to uh, to Shellot now and so the temperature has gone up to 46 degrees Celsius and now we are charging at 25 kilowatts so 
yeah, you should you should charge about seventy five uh, percent every time. I mean, even even if you don't have this tool, you can you can see it here also. Um, if you switch here, uh, da, 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 da. Uh, here you see it's down to twenty six now. So this is time to leave. We have been driving for a bit. I don't know how long. Maybe let's ha let's say half an hour ish. Yeah. So we're down to. 49% yeah the temperature is still minus 6 I think that helps a little bit because uh, right now we are at 43.4 uh, so the temperature is slowly rising yeah that's good we need it to drop a little bit more before we uh, go to the fast charger but based on these results so far it's like it's it's almost no no big deal if you arrive at 40 degrees Celsius because we will still get okay charging speed yeah, so we have to see then, uh, we are about uh, 50 kilometers away now, getting close to the end now. Alright, we are now on the stretch between uh, Elverum and uh, Löten, and we also have some road construction here, so the, the traffic is going slow. Yeah, it's going at some 55 kilometers per hour-ish. Uh, and that also means that the temperature should be dropping faster. I've been hammering it too much though. Too many overtakes. So it's at 41.8 now. Yeah. So we'll see in a bit. In uh, what is this? Um, nine kilometers will be at the fast charger. Yeah, and let me juice up and see what, what happens over there. Yeah, what happens in Lurton stays in Lurton. All right, we are back at Löten. We have 14% uh, left here. That is perfect for juicing up. You don't want to go too low, because then you build up more heat. Consumption was 179 for this leg. And if you look here, at lead spy, we have 40.9 degrees Celsius. So I think it was 70, no, it was 47 when it left, wasn't it? So we, we lost like six degrees Celsius, not much at all. So it seems like um, we lose. I mean, uh, we don't uh, we don't get more cooling. So it seems like the car is basically the same as the old one. It's just that they changed the software. All right, let's plug in and see what speed we get. Okay, let's see. This would be 27 kilowatt before. What are we gonna get? Oh, 36. Oh. Ho, ho, ho. 37, it's ramping up. 38. Let me, let me fire up the car so it, it doesn't die. Okay. Thir whoa, ho, ho. 40 kilowatts. What the heck? That is great news. This is. Rapid gate has been cured. Yeah. Wow. Look at that. Okay, this is uh, interesting. We test now, we replug it at 45 degrees Celsius to simulate what happens if we arrive with that hot battery and plug in. And before we were getting, what was in, some people say it was some 20 kilowatts. Ah, you see now? Yeah, because, so I have to explain here. The car will check the temperature at the plug-in time and then set the maximum speed for the whole charging session so we were getting 40 kilowatts this same thing happened before with the old version is that when you unplug and plug in uh, you will get lower speed so yeah okay they say that um, before we would get only 22 kilowatts now the BMS will allow 32 that is a huge difference it it means a lot for uh, fast charging on long trips or whatever that you get 10 kilowatt more yeah, so, um, okay, I kind of, I lose a little bit of time now because um, I would have been getting 40 kilowatt, but right now I'm getting 32, but we are doing this in the name of science. Yeah, so maybe we should try to uh, replug again, let's say at 48 uh, degrees to get another um, measuring point. All right, this is the third charging stop. So I had some, f I had a hot dog at the first charging stop and then the second was just restroom break and now the third one which is several hours after the first so then I have uh, some hot chocolate oh yeah uh, yes that's good hot chocolate and some buns but 
these are not ESPA buttons because it's all about timing. We don't have time to go to ESPA. We have to charge here and then Nebenes, I think. So no ESPA button, just the more like regular buttons from. Mm, not the same. Esper buns are the best. These are like dry-ish, kind of tasteless. Right? You want? I mean, it, it kind of works if you have some hot chocolate, but go for Esper buns. Those are the best. Uh, all right, we are about to leave Lurton. We have charged to eighty-two percent in the display. It's minus three degrees Celsius. Uh, leaf spices. Oh, sorry. Uh, Leaf Spy report 78-ish. One out there just there. 78. The pack is at 50 degrees Celsius. Yeah, and we are going for IKEA, 115 kilometers away. So let's uh, hammer it. Well, not gonna hammer it, but let's go. <laughs> we have been driving for a little bit, and here is the bridge. Yes, this road connects to E6. So from here on, it will be uh, more away, all the way to Oslo. Uh, I could drive at 110 or maybe even 120 kilometers per hour, but I will stick to the 90 kilometers per hour uh, just to see what happens. I know that if I drive too fast, then the heat will build up. Yeah, so we'll uh, we have to drive slow. <laughs> we have been driving for 48 minutes, and uh, just like the the other legs today, see. Consumption is 180. Yes, yeah, it's very consistent. So we can use that one uh, to estimate how much we need and all that. So um, temperature is minus one. And if you look over here now, um, you see that uh, we, when we left the fast charger, we had 50 degrees Celsius. Oh, let me just do it. Yeah. We had 50, and it has only dropped to 46. We only lost about uh, three and a half degrees in 45 minutes <laughs> yeah so it's going very slow and I'm only driving at 90 kilometers per hour uh, if I drive at 110 like some people suggested I do then the temperature will rise and then once you go to the next fast charger you will have rapid speed so you know, I'd say that um, the rapid gate has been fixed or improved a lot but that doesn't mean that you can hammer it it depends like if you only have to drive 200 300 kilometers yes then you can hammer it if you have to drive far let's say 400 500 kilometers then you still have to take it easy like I do oh yes we are cruising along now blasting the music yeah <laughs> Live stream people wanted to listen to the music, so I put in the music. Uh, looking good so far. We have 27 kilometers left, and we have 45.4 degrees Celsius. Slowly cooling down. Yeah. We are now back in Oslo at IKEA. So let's see. We came here with. Oh, let me get the sign check. Check it out. It was 45 degrees Celsius when we plug in. What do we get? What do we get? 30. Is it ramping up? 30. 30 kilowatt. Whew. Wait, are we gonna get more? Let's fire up the car. Yeah, 30 kilowatt. It's not too bad. Like, I guess we can we can look up, but the 45 degrees should be like 22 or something, around 12, just a little over 20 before the fix. So 30 is still way better than 20 something. Yeah. Okay. So this is the third. No, wait. I mean, this is the fourth fast charging session. So, okay, even the fourth fast charging session is like. It's okay, but I think the fourth would be like the last you should do in this day if you have to drive far. Then you should consider uh, finding a hotel or sleep in the car. Yeah. <laughs> well, okay, they say that 25 degrees Celsius before was 22 kilowatts, so this is uh, 8 kilowatt higher than before. Hmm, great. So, yes, that's it then. Uh, this uh, Rabbit Gate test road trip thingy yeah 
So uh, I will make another video where I have to, I mean, I have to look and analyze the data and that will take like a whole day for me to dig into this data. And I will also look into the data uh, from uh, from before, for the, for before the fix. So, but anyway, at least you saw some of the stuff now. So I can say that Nissan, they fixed the, the rapid gate uh, with the newer cars. And uh, based on what I've seen here, it seems like there is no hardware improvement. The the temperature still drops very slowly like before. It's just that the software, I guess, allows you to charge at higher speed, at higher temperature. Whether that is healthy or not for the battery is a different question. We don't know yet. Um, but yeah, I guess some, I mean, many people probably don't care that they degrade a little bit. Like maybe they will keep the car for one year or maybe they don't, they don't fast charge that often. So the few times they need to fast charge, they just want it to go fast. Yeah, and most of the time maybe they just, locally charged slow at home and then they drive around town so yeah but anyway i hope i uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video as always thank you for watching and talk to you later